Welcome back guys. Um, today we're going to be doing for the first time doing a planning. Um, so we're going to start with the month of June. I already have it planned in my wallet over here but I wanted to do it big. Again if you haven't seen my last video opening my budget planner this is for um, Christina loves planning and um, we're gonna get started here real quick. I'll go ahead and add the days. So I don't have stickers or anything. I'll try and make some uh, myself. I actually like holding it. So I'll try and make some myself later or buy some, but for the moment we're gonna be, oops. We're gonna be filling out the numbers. I'm just going to do this, copy in the one that I have over here. This wallet and the budget planner over here is also from Christina Loves Planning. I loved it so much that we decided to go with her again. So first time I, I'm actually um, planning. So if you guys do something different or if you have some tips for me, please let me know down below in the comments section. Maybe I'm going to be a boring video at a do. Again, this is the first time I'm doing this. So so now that I have that, I usually go in first and put my paydays and my husband's paydays. So the fifth, uh, we're going to get paid. So I'm just going to put a dot and put payday or just pay. And then the 19th, I get paid bi-weekly. I only work one day a week. So it's only like 100 bucks that I get, but hey, better than nothing. And then Friday is when my husband gets paid, so we'll go ahead and put that. So now that I have it big, this is going to be the days, um, I'm sorry, the monthly overview that I'm going to use like for personal use. So um, these days we have church assembly, so I'm just going to put it right here. Okay, so that's that. And that's it for this one. I don't have anything else going on that I know. So we're going to go ahead and switch to the next page, which is now the bill tracker and the monthly overview of the um, bills. So again, we're going to put the month. I like that it has two because then you're not going back and forth, checking on your bills and like that, you know. But it is annoying that I have to fill out the days. But at the same time, I like it because it's not dated. You know, I can use it whenever I want. So, I don't know. It's a pro and a con. Just need to get used to it, I guess. Or buy stickers. <laughs> I don't know if you guys heard that, but I said, or buy stickers. So, okay. I kind of like mumble sometimes or speak really, really softly. So, I do apologize for that. So, the reason we're doing this now, it's because if you guys didn't see the last video, um, my husband and I are joining bank accounts. So, now... I'm going to be taking care of everything in the house uh, regarding like budgeting and planning for payments and all that. So that's why we wanted this. This one's mostly for me to keep track, to have all the time with me in the wallet. And this one's, um, I mean, also for me, but for my husband to come back to my desk and be like, okay, let me see if she already paid that. That's still in my head. Like it's going to take a while for him to actually trust me, you know, so. All right, so we're going to put here the days and what, what it is. This is going to vary for every person. This is just what we have and how much everything is here where we live. So if you think it's low, if you think it's high, again, it depends for your situation. We're just writing minimum. I'm not going to put the whole amount for our cards. We're just putting the minimum in there. I'm not gonna, I don't feel comfortable sharing it right now still. We do have a lot of debt, so I do like having everything wrote down. It has been helping me for May to kind of like, we were kind of practicing May to see um, the bills that were coming out and all that, you know, so I'm excited. Excited, nervous. <sighs> I just hope any, nothing gets cut off. That's my biggest worry, that I didn't pay it and they call me and they were late. I'm going to try big time, but we'll see what happens. Keep on watching the videos later on to see how I'm doing. Do you guys take care of your expenses and stuff? 
in home or do you guys do it separately i just want to know what works best for you guys maybe this won't work for me later on i have we don't know i don't know if i'm gonna be able to do everything like payments online and all that that my husband usually takes care of and i don't know if he's gonna feel comfortable like asking me do we have money for this did you already pay this like i don't know we'll see we are also planning to cancel some of these memberships and stuff so that will help us a little bit to have enough our goal is to um hopefully get a month ahead here soon like the next six months hopefully by the end of the year have a month ahead in oral sorry all our bills and stuff it's gonna be hard when your budget is low and you have all this to pay you know but we're gonna definitely try making sure i'm not missing anything here can i just say something my hands are already hurting <laughs> i hope you guys can understand my handwriting it's not the best i hope it's not the worst either okay so that's it so now i'm gonna mark the paydays on this one too okay now in red i'm gonna go ahead and mark everything here on this side so that i know okay so the first is mortgage i was about to say can we have a day without nothing and then we only have one <laughs> You might hear my daughter making some noise over there. They're out of school, so I don't have a good time to actually do my videos anymore. Other than waking up early, early in the morning or when she's already asleep. But um, with her autism, sometimes she sleeps all the way to like 11, 12, even though I give her melatonin. It's kind of like crazy, but it is what it is. And guys, I don't know if you saw right here. Where was it? Click it. I actually got a Cricut machine. I'm so excited because I'll be able to do my stickers, my envelopes. I don't know uh, if you guys saw in the last video again. Um, I made my whole like bill binder now. So I'm excited. I'm excited. Hopefully in the future I'll be able to sell. I don't know if somebody will like my envelopes or my stickers or anything. But I'm actually excited, you know. I don't have a sticker here with me to show you. But yeah anyways that's out of the point um so now what i'm gonna do is since here we get paid the 31st that check is gonna actually go towards june to start saving for that so we're gonna go ahead and mark from here all the way to my husband's check which um, oops i'm gonna be doing like this okay so now we're gonna grab from the 31st to the 7th and uh, highlight all of that so all these are gonna be taken care of with the 31st paycheck okay so now we're gonna do the same but we're gonna grab the pink one just so that we know there are different colors i'm gonna mark all the way from the 8th to the 14th green color I'm doing the same thing. Let me know if you have any other suggestions of doing this. This is what worked for me on May or in May, I should say. So that's why we're doing this again. But we can try something different if it has worked for you guys. Just let me know. And my daughter needs me again. Okay, I'm going to do the same thing here. Okay. And then this day we're going to get paid. We're going to get paid. My husband is going to get paid. So that is going to cover for July. Okay, so expense tracker is what we are going to be using for my wallet. I'll go ahead and put wallet here. And I'm going to put the days, but whenever I'm doing the cash stuffing, because then I want to put the amount here. So here we're not going to have wallet. I mean, we're going to have um this in here we're just gonna put wallet all right so this is just the envelopes that are on my wallet again coffee personal grocery eating out family fun and miscellaneous again we're gonna do this whenever i'm doing the cash stuff okay and then we do mid-month we're gonna do a check of the wallet sinking funds i think i'm gonna do whatever is on this binder because the this other one is bills so i'm not gonna do that one so we're gonna put cart maintenance and then that one we have 60 beginning balance so we have 60 
in case we add some or if some comes out, then we know we can write right here the end balance that will have on that envelope. Donations I'm not going to write. And then we have beauty. We have zero. Clothing. We have zero. Pets. I'm kind of liking my um, kind of like simple envelopes. Remember, if you guys are new, you haven't seen, but like I was making my envelopes like this before, you know, like a little bit more fun, but like for pets, I don't know. I'm glad that I switched at the same time. Okay, so pets, we have zero. Tamales, this is the envelope that I use for selling. We usually put 160, so that should be there. Golf, I know we only have 50. Gifts, we have zero. I just spent it. House, nothing. YouTube, this is for my YouTube creation. Um, anything that I want to do, like a giveaway or, or something, then I'll use it from here. Back to school, need to start saving here for my daughter, but I have nothing right now. Vacation, we have 40. And visiting family is kind of similar to vacation, but this is mostly just for going and seeing our family in Mexico or somewhere else. Okay, now we only have 20. Okay, so that's it for my sinking funds and we have set savings tracker so this will be right here um i don't want to count the money that i have here though yeah i don't want to count the money there so we're just gonna leave it empty if we don't use some pages that's okay i don't have to use everything credit card tracker i will use this but i'll do this off camera again i'm not doing it in camera that tracker, same thing, but I'll do these two out of camera unless I want to do something else. And then paychecks, again, I don't have any paychecks yet because we're not starting, but um, I'll just put the first paycheck and that would include uh, me and my husband or my husband and me and paycheck. And I think that's it, guys. Yeah, it has four. It has task list has a saving challenge in case I want to do that have it tracker like drink water and then what days I did it this is cool okay and notes and that's it so I hope you guys enjoyed uh, the video of how I plan to do my planning in my new budget budget planner if you guys have any questions let me know or any um, advice that I should do then please go ahead and let me know. Again, I do love this one. Uh, it has been helping me during the month of May. Um, but since we're joining accounts, then we're go going to have two planners. Same thing. It's just one I carry with me all the time so I can keep track of all the payments and the other ones just to give my husband a peace of mind and for me to double check, you know, and be able to decorate it a little bit more because since it's bigger, I can write bigger, I can put stickers, I can, yeah, everything. All right, thank you so much. You guys have a great day. Bye-bye. <laughs>